When keeping it real goes wrong. So I'm Dave, and I keep it real. Sometimes keeping it real can go horribly wrong. We gotta pick our spots. It's good to be real sometimes. It's good to be phony sometimes. Yes, I said it. Phony. Think I'm this nice in real life? F that, son. It's Cause I'm on TV. What is going on, everybody? I'm back with another video, and um, once again, I'm using Sunny Liston. You know, a lot of people. You know, in the Fight Night community or people that play this game know it's extremely difficult to get a win. Look, you see him taunting right there. He did that for the first two rounds or like the first three rounds. At the end of every round, he would taunt. His activity, his punch output was higher than mine. So he was winning the early rounds like that. But with Liston, your defense has to be on point because they gave him a weak chin in his game. And Joe Lewis, uh, his power, you know, is... His power is up there, so if you get caught with a couple of shots, you can get knocked out. Look at him taunting again. You see him. I was like, man, don't let me, don't let me come back and whoop your ass, man. Because if you taunting and I whoop your ass with an 82 overall, it's a bad look. It's not, it's not gonna look too good. But you see right here, we're playing an in and out game, the back and forth, where I act like I'm gonna go and throw a punch and I'll back up because he's throwing that leaping jab and the leaping straight right, and I'm not trying to get stunned with that. So I was very careful. I was just on my defense for the first couple rounds, and he was the one throwing more punches. I would just jab to the body, try to get him a little bit tired. Like that in the later rounds, his punches wouldn't have the same sting to it. So we're gonna go to the body, and then boom, we catch him with the straight right. I guess he uh, threw too many punches there, and the little jab to the body got stamina down even more than with the power straight right to the head. See how I set that up? See, and the thing is, with Liston, you want to utilize his straight right and you want to utilize the power shot perfectly. You want to do it correctly. You don't want to just throw the straight right, throw the straight right. Then you'll be predictable and you can be easy to count. You got to set it up because the Liston straight right is his best punch. It's 20 out of 20. So you got to utilize that. And I don't know why his jab isn't maxed out or close to being maxed out because Liston had one of the greatest left jabs in the heavyweight in boxing history. It was a piston-like jab. He had a dynamic jab. He would use it a lot. And he could knock people out with a jab. So, I mean, but it works pretty good still. With Even with his low ratings in this game. They did Sunny Liston so dirty in this game. It's not even funny. Like, it's crazy. But, you know, uh, they can taunt again after he already got knocked down. So, he starts to get more aggressive after the knockdown. Trying to knock me down and stuff. But that just backfires on him later on. Because my defense was just on point this match. And the keys to victory, whenever you want to use, excuse me, use Sonny Liston, you have to stay on the outside, utilize your jab. Liston isn't obviously the fastest heavyweight in this game. So you have to, it's timing. Timing is everything. You have to perfectly time that jab, jab to the body, then to the head. Because when people hold that block button, if you jab to the head every time, the player will anticipate the block to the head and then you mix it up with you have to the body you'll be able to get through the guard because he won't be able to block because they have this auto block in this game you'll be able to get through the guard so you mix it up body head body head boom straight right you'll throw a hook or uppercut in there sometimes and you just gotta fight a very extremely careful fight on the outside and you have to fight damn near perfect with listing committing to the body work with the double jab Oh, you see how we started tagging him right there, right? If only that round lasted a couple more seconds, I feel like I would've got the knockdown in that round, but it's all good. Patience is everything. We do end up knocking him down later on in the fight. So at this point in the fight, he's not being the aggressor anymore. He's like kind of backing up because in the earlier rounds with his high punch output and high uh, activity, he was throwing a lot of power shots too. And I was, as I was jabbing to the body for those first three, four rounds, that was killing his stamina even more. And Listen doesn't even have high punch stats for uh, the body punches. So, I mean, that tells you something. You have to, it's all about pace, keeping your pace. I didn't throw any really power shots like that in the first couple of rounds. I was just throwing jabs and straight to the body because uh, utilizing his long reach, 84 inch reach, you got to use it. 
and you see it at the later rounds you start to get we start to be the aggressor and come forward and we get to sidestep hook to the body sidestep uppercut power shot to the body then mix it up back up jab jab you're gonna see how we do this cat later on Mean power shots to the body. And y'all know me, man. I'm petty. I had to I had to press that replay button one more time because this man was taunting. He hit that taunt button like for the first three rounds. Even after he got knocked down for the first time. So you know I had to. So after the second knockdown, you know, it's round nine. Couple seconds left. You got one more round. Just finish strong or just, you know. We could just dance around the ring and try to have him chase me and have him run into something. But, you know, we didn't get the knockout, but we got the decision win. Wanna win? My headshot's locked. Liston's putting forth a great combination there. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. Nice block that time. It was intended to the head. How about a return to center with the left hand? Final bell of what is tough to fight to score. I mean, you could make a case in every round for both guys. That is all you need to know how difficult this decision will be. Never gonna forget this evening. He was. 